on the fifth wheel. The way he smiles, his charm, mm -hmm. or, his way, or his package. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the size of the package, it's what you can do with the merchandise. yoga booty ballet and we're gonna start with ballet second position plie so put one hand on your belly and one hand above your booty good and then go down and come up good just a basic plie okay keep your butt under you instead of behind you he needs to stay in control of his butt okay. <laughs> I do do you sometimes would you ever date a cheerleader like a girl no. I hope not. Well, I don't know. Well, but actually. No, I'm just kidding. Really? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> what? No. I mean, that would change because of that conversation here. <laughs> would you ever have Would I ever, girl? would I ever hook up with a girl? Um, you know, I wouldn't actually have a relationship with a girl, but I wouldn't mind experimenting with a girl. Really? Well, my friend and I have, have not really kissed, kissed, but we've, like, touched tongues, you know, just touch each other's boobs, whatever, no big deal. <laughs> I'm not feeling our uh, energy anymore. <laughs> I, know, I know, Dude, your hands are sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> I can't hold on. <laughs> so with a guy, you're more, with feelings, with a girl, you're more sexual. Probably, yeah. yeah. Okay, that's, that's, that's kind of cool. I analyze things to death. I just, you know, I try not to. Just like plainly, like go to the club, you get it on, mm -hmm. you take on a couple numbers. That's like how I'd sum it up, probably. But really, yeah. But you're more of an intellectual girl, talkative, whatever, analyzing. Mm-hmm. Analyzing. Yeah. Whatever. I'm more of a action, not a thinker, I guess. Really? Yeah. Alana she has good teeth. She's more caring, and she has a prettier face. I don't know if I'm down with the whole guy cheerleader trying to uh, get free grabs. I think Regina is really cool. Uh, she's really smart and intelligent. Yuri and I have some kind of connection thing going on. I don't know what it is, whether it be a friend thing or a hookup thing, whatever. All right, let's play musical chairs with our singles and swap partners. What's your special talent? My special talent? Like, what, like being able to put my leg over my head or something? Or Can what? you do that? Huh? <laughs> Probably. Okay, let's see that. It was crazy. I heard it was like all sexual yoga and oh, everything. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but see, it would have been fun if like, it would have been like a sexual person, but she's not like that sexual. If she was more like, oh, like all over you, then would you have been more like? <laughs> um, no, it's just like not her personality to be like that. So yeah. do you want a girl like that? Ah, uh, yeah, I like girls that like to touch and like to, you know, play around a little bit. Oh, can you do the other one? Um. The first day, is touching, like, important for you? And if, yeah, yeah, touching. For do you me, like when you get touched? Oh, I love getting touched all over. <laughs> <laughs> a little help here, no. <laughs> there we go. Holding hands is a lot more than... Well, it means a lot more to me than just kissing. Like, you can, I can just kiss, like, guys, you know, randomly or whatever, but holding hands is something I don't do unless I'm serious with you. Wow. Yeah. So you do usually kiss on the first date? Yeah, yeah, if it happens, it happens. All right, so this is my talent, I guess, okay. you want to say. There's, uh, you can go, like, that and just smile, you know. <laughs> Okay. Watch the girl walk by, you go, hey. All right, you try it. <laughs> it's not happening. You okay? Oh, yeah, nothing permanent. So how many girls have you kissed? Round it off. What, 80, 90? <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> um, a lot. <laughs> Probably, like, a couple hundred. Oh, my gosh, are you <laughs> kidding me? Steve. Regina's more sensual. She's more into like life. Justin was too quiet, 
too little boyish for me. Lana's really cool. I think she has her morals right. I think she's a sweet girl. Yuri is really, really cool. Um, I've felt so far very comfortable with him, just talking to him. So supposedly Alana is the sweet one and Regina is the more frisky one, but Regina won't hold hands unless she's serious, while Alana apparently will put her leg behind her head for a complete stranger. Take it easy, Alana. Save the physical contortion for the third date. All right, so the girls are gravitating towards one guy, but I guarantee the attraction will diversify when we introduce our fifth wheel. And that is next. Coming up. Let there be light. We'll be on top after the fifth wheel rolls in. I'll ride you to the cow's couple. That's next. Was explaining her honesty and confidence to Yuri while Regina watched as Alana licked frosting off of Justin's lip. Well, the romantic contest is entering its final heat. So let's join our players as they go for broke. <laughs> Cheers, you guys. Cheers. 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 So, Alana, would you like to go for a walk with Look, me? I love it. Look out. Hey, oh. cheers. Cheers. Hey. Bye, hey. guys. Have hey. fun. You know what? Be good, all right? Because <laughs> I'm all like, I'll just bank your ass. Okay. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Where's this blind date going? Where is this blind date going? Um, you mean as a group or as just you and me? You and me. Well, um... How do you like the guys? He, I know you, Justin is totally into you. I know that is bad. Yeah, well. <laughs> You're just like, yeah, I you know. know. I, I, I came here. So gorgeous. I don't think that um, that we have any awkwardness between each other. We pretty much can say what we feel and, and be accepted and not being judged by the other person. Because I hate when people get so opinionated and judgmental that they like, oh, she's a total whore because she's made like one stupid comment. I'll ride you to the cows come home. Justin is a little more like, I don't know if he's just a bit timid or younger. I don't know what it is, but he just seems more to himself and yeah. more like mysterious. Like I can't yeah. figure him out yet. Mm -hmm. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Natalie, how you doing? I'm good, how are you? The drink's good? It's great. Can we um, go for a walk? Sure, let's go. What do you think? I don't know. I think you're pretty cool. I like it. I like what I see. Can I be real honest with you? I get the impression that you care more about physical than yeah. you do anything else. That's the impression that I get. No, not at all. I mean, looks count, of course. Anybody who of says course, that? of course they yeah, do. Yeah, that's course. what I'm saying. Like, looks have to be there, right. along with the personality, along with the speech, the physical, you know, I mean, the emotional stuff, you know? Right. Is Natalie exotic to you? <laughs> she's the beautiful type. She's like, beautiful or not, or exotic? She's or not she exotic. Not? Oh, she's not exotic, really? Not to me. That's Ooh. an impression, and it could be totally off. I think it's off because I don't think you figured me out yet. As you have not figured me out yet either. Exactly. I think that's why I'm interested. That's why I picked you. <laughs> because you're a mystery to me. You know what I'm saying? Well, I must say that this has been interesting. Hi, I'm my friends. <gasps> We're trying to Good. be uh, mysterious and find out so we can, like, not hurt anybody's feelings. <laughs> <laughs> you want to sit down? You want to sit down? Yeah, you want to go take a walk? I would love to, like, talk oh, to you a little bit. Cool. Kind of, hey. You know. So what did you and Natalie talk about? Dude, Natalie was, like, in her own <laughs> world, dude. What are you talking about? She's like, I'm independent, I'm this, I'm that. I'm like... She's she's just not looking for a boyfriend. You know that, though, right? <laughs> Is she even looking to have fun? Do you know any girl that's not looking for a boyfriend? What are you getting out of this experience? That's a good question. Um, new friends, I hope. Cool. Uh, first and foremost, new friends. Um, I don't know. It's it's a tough question. All I was argue with her every f there, dude. Really? So annoying, yeah. Oh, that's right. She was annoying she's, as she's hell, born dude. In December, I forgot about that. <clears throat> she was annoying, dude. I think that Absolutely. we had the most real conversation out of everything. I think you weren't trying to impress me with your looks. You were like totally just laid back. Kick back. You know, beautiful that's girl. That's the story of my life. <laughs> Kick so back. So mine. I'm totally being serious. Why why fit the personality that they want if that's not you? Because you're the one who's going to end up getting screwed in the process. Yeah. You know what I mean? Totally. So what do you think is going to go on right now? I don't know. What do you want to go on right now? I don't know. No? 
she does or something. <laughs> you think? Maybe. Okay. Yeah. Why? Well, I had a really good time getting to know you, though. I really did. I, I think we should all hang out again. I think this yeah. is fun. Cool. Whatever. Is that what you had in mind? I'll ride you to the cows go home. Definitely. Coming up, he blew me away. Our daters walk that thin line between love and hate. This chick was driving me nuts, dude. That's next. Welcome back to the fifth wheel. When we last left our players, Justin finally got in sync with Alana, Yuri was feeling a normal 98 degrees with Natalie, and Regina was wondering when the new Backstreet Boys album was coming out. Well, now it's time for our players to come clean. So let's join them in the bus as they tell us who they want to see again. Justin, I'm looking for a guy who is more mature. Yuri, I just thought you were too much of a hopeless romantic, so I picked nobody. Tonight, it just seemed like I was just out with a couple of boys. One of you was a little too different from me. Another one of you is too much like my best friend. Therefore, I choose nobody. Both of the guys are really sweet. They'd be perfect for someone out there, not for me. Ladies, I had a great time with all of you. I think you guys are really cool, but there was only one of you that I got a chance to dance with, and I would love to have another dance with you, and that's Alana. Alana's so cool, and I love that she took the opportunity to dance with me. There was one girl that made me feel really special, and that girl was Alana. You know, it's like, Natalie was driving me damn nuts, all right? It's like, dude, look, you're a chick, I'm a dude, you know? Yuri and Justin both went for Alana. So let's see who Alana wants to put in her Rolodex. Yuri or Justin? I had an awesome time with both of you guys tonight, and the person that I seemed to really connect with tonight was Yuri. Oh. Yuri's a great catch. Yuri and I just, just bonded from the very beginning. Alana was, like, such a player. Natalie was the lamest, I think. They're all kind of confused. Indifference was a major problem. Whatever it is I said, they kind of went along with. I don't really care. I'm not too worried about it. Ah, you're right, Justin. Don't worry about it. Oh, and by the way, the girls weren't confused. They just can't date a guy wearing nicer earrings than they are. And that wraps up this immature episode. Join us next time on The Fifth Wheel, where strangers become friends. Friends become lovers, and lovers become bitter, suicidal exes, all in the same show. I'm Aisha Tyler. See you next time. You're watching KSWB, San Diego's home for comedy. Laugh out loud tonight starting at 6 with all your favorites. Friends, Just Shoot Me, and Everybody Loves Raymond. Up next, it's Jenny Jones, only on KSWB 569.